Hey G Squad, welcome back to of Is It Profit? So base episode, we got this cool observer here. And plus what this is, is a platform bed frame. And we see for the one that we got right here is a 14 inch and it is for the full size bed. They do have this available in different size. So if you want like twin size, queen size, or king size, you definitely want to do your own measurement and research to see what you prefer. But right here is what the package looks like when you guys do get it. Let me actually open up and show you guys what the inside looks like. So here we got the first part. And then here we do have the second one. And that is pretty much everything that's included inside. So I'll put this on one side for now. So literally once you guys do take it out, it's just two pieces inside. I'm assuming you guys have to screw something together to hold it in place. But let's take it out from the wrapper first. So once you guys do take it out, here's what it looks like. So first thing inside right here, they do provide you guys a user manual to teach you guys how to set it up and how to use it. So they do have like step-by-step -step instruction, but pretty much what you guys want to do is to open up both of them. And once you guys open it and put it side by side, they mention how you guys want to use the uh, accessory to actually screw it together so that we can hold the frame together when you guys do use it. And you see right here in step five. So one right now is to take out this part right here first to show you guys what it actually looks like in terms of accessory that's provided. So right here is a tool or the accessory that you guys need to use. So this is what the part looks like when you guys do get it. And I believe if you guys get the twin size option, you probably don't need that because you probably just get one of these and not two of them. If you guys get the full size, then you guys do get two of them. But let's cut the other one as well and we'll open up to show you guys how to assemble it. So now let's open up to show us how to assemble it. So you guys want to open it all the way. And once you guys open it all the way, then you just have to pull the legs open on both sides. Let me adjust the camera so that we can see it. So hopefully I can see in the video, but literally all you need to do is just lift it up. And it pretty much locks in automatically. Same thing for this side. And it locks in right there. And if you guys do need to release it to fold it back up, you just want to pull this part right here on both sides. And that will allow you guys to bring it back down, which is pretty cool. So very easy and very simple for you guys to assemble it and put it away. But I'm just gonna open up both of them and put it side by side to show you guys how to assemble it if you guys were to put it together. So let's flip this over. And I'm gonna do the same thing for the other one and put it side by side. All right, so once you guys got it all set up, now you can put it together and use the screw to screw it together. But then see how it's actually really cool how it doesn't require any two to screw it together when you guys do set this part up. Because a lot of other bed frames, if you guys see them in the past in terms of like the Amazon basic brand, you guys have to actually screw each different part for the legs. Where for this one not required, you just have to open it up and fold it back down, which is pretty cool. But now let's put this part together to show you guys how it works. So literally all you need to do is put it side by side. And what you guys want to do is put this part right here through it. So I'm actually show you guys what it looks like if you guys were doing. So this would go through in first, and this should be in the middle in between both of them. So that way it won't damage the bed frame when you guys do something together. And the other end will go on this side right here to screw it in. So I'm actually put it in first and show you guys what I mean. It's gonna be hard for me to multitask, so I'll just put it in first. So this one goes in right here. This one goes in the middle. Put it together and screw this part in. And it's all set. So let's do the same thing for this side. All right, so once you guys finish that, then you guys are pretty much all set. And now you can pretty much put your mattress on top and you guys are all set. And like I mentioned for the product, it is foldable. So if you guys want to fold it together, you do have the option to fold it together or you guys can unscrew both of them and keep it separate, which is pretty cool. But once you guys do set it up, this is what the product looks like. So like I mentioned for the one that we do have right here is the full size option. If you guys do want to get the king size, the twin size, that is totally up to you guys. But that is pretty much everything that's on the product. So very easy and very simple for you to assemble it and does not take that long. I think this literally took me less than 10 minutes to assemble it. And it probably took you guys less than 10 minutes to put away when you guys are moving to a different place or something. I personally like this a lot more, especially if you guys plan on moving a lot. Because if you guys get like the bigger bed frame option with the headrest option or headboard option, that one takes a lot more work for you guys to disassemble it and put away. Where for this one, just take up both sides, fold it up and it's all set. And just to show you guys how stable the product is, if I do lay down on here without the mattress on here, let me show you guys what it looks like. So this actually looks like if you guys were laid down on here. Obviously, it's not as comfortable compared to when you guys put a mattress, but you see how it's actually very stable when you do use it. So it will support a lot of weight once you guys do put down your mattress on here. So for those of you who are curious about how to put it away, let me show you guys real quick. It's very easy and very simple. Just reverse the same step of what you guys just did in terms of putting each different screw on the middle. Take it apart. 
put this on one side and do the same thing for our side. And just fold it back up. Do one of them at a time so that way you don't hurt yourself. So push it down on both sides. Same thing for this side. And then fold it back up. And then do the same thing for other one and it's all set. So just like that, very easy and very simple, I've been seeing. So that is everything that's on the product. Now to go unboxing and test the product. Now to answer the question of whether or not it's worth or not. So for this product, I do have to say that it's pretty worth it. If you guys want to need one of these, especially if you guys are in the market looking for a high quality foldable bed frame that give you guys this part right here, that's very durable. So that way you don't have to buy like a separate bed frame to hold the actual mattress on top. That's also very easy for you to set it up and put it away when you guys do move or something then I do have to say that it is pretty worth it. <laughs> but then obviously for those of you guys who don't want or don't need one or haven't wanted these, that obviously don't buy one and save your mind something else you actually do need. So that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That will definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys so you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace. Thank you.